channel so I did this fall like kind of neutral inspired look um, let me know if you guys like it and um, I did this as like a talk through which I usually don't do I usually just do voiceovers but I decided to do something different so let me know if you guys prefer for me to do my videos like this where I'm talking to you actually while I'm doing it or if you would like um, voiceovers or if you don't want me to say anything at all um, but yeah so this is the finished look and if you want to see how I got it then just keep watching. So first thing I'm going to be using um, this primer. Now I'm going to be using my Shea Moisture Foundation. It's really dirty but you know whatever and the pump is broken so I'm gonna have to put like a little bit like that this stuff is really full coverage so you don't really need to put a lot unless you want a full coverage look then I'm taking my damp beauty blender it's dirty but LA Girl Concealer in the color Fawn and putting that um, under my eyes. And then I'm going in with, for some added drama, um, the yellow LA Girl Concealer, the yellow corrector, just to brighten up down there. gonna blend that out now I'm taking my Sasha cosmetics um, powder this is not the um, buttercup this is just a regular face powder and I'm gonna use this to set the concealer under my eyes. I'm using a Real Techniques Beauty Blender to apply this powder. Now I'm gonna sit there and let that bake and now I'm taking my MAC powder uh, mineralized skin finish in the color dark and I'm gonna use that to set um, the rest of my face. Now I'm going to do my brows and I'm going to be using the Anastasia um, dip brow pomade in the color dark brown. taking some of that LA Girl Concealer and um, cleaning up my brows a bit. And I'm just going to be blending the concealer out. Now I'm going to be taking um, this Black Radiance Press Powder and you can see I've hit pan on it because I use it so much and it's broken. But I'm going to be using that to contour my nose. So 
So I like to leave this to set for a while. I'm not gonna leave my nose like this, but I like to leave it to sit like that for a while. And then I'm gonna be taking some of my CoverGirl um, Queen Collection in medium deep. This is a this is a pressed powder, and I use this to bronze my face. And then once I'm done bronzing my face, I will go in and um, blend out that contour. So now I'm going to be going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer and I'm going to be using that as a primer for my eyes. Okay, so I have not been putting on um, eyeshadow or anything like that because I have lash extensions in. They are obviously falling out at this point so you can't even really see them anymore. But I've been trying to stay away from putting on eyeshadows. So I'm going to be taking my Shade and Light palette and I am going to be using this shade. And I'm going to be using that as my transition color. I'm going to be taking my Morphe 350 palette. I'm going to be using this color. I'm going to be putting that on the outer corner. I'm just going to be blending all that together. And I'm going back into my shade and light palette and I am going to be taking um, this brown shade right here and I'm going to be putting that on the um, outer corner as well. And I'm like slowly bringing it into my inner corner. And I'm going to be taking my big old fluffy brush and just blending that together. Now I'm going to be taking a flat shader brush and I am going to be using this shade and I'm going to be putting that all over my lid. And then I'm going to be taking that same shade and I'm going to be putting it on my brow bone. And then I'm going to be taking that fluffy brush one more time and just making sure everything is blended and seamless. And then under my eyes, I am going to be taking this shade right here. I'm going to be using that and putting that under my eyes. taking this eyeliner okay so like I mentioned I have lash extensions on so I can't put any mascara on the top of my lashes so I'm only gonna put them on the bottom which is really annoying but I don't think you can. If you guys know if I can put mascara on lash extensions, let me know. I might as well put them on because they're falling out. But I'm just going to only put them at the bottom. Now I'm going to be going in with my Laura Geller um, Quilted Honey. And I'm going to be putting that... Now to set off the fall look, I am going to be taking um, these NYX matte, soft matte lip creams and I have it in Dubai, which is like a brown color. And then I'm going to be going 
mixing it kind of with Transylvania. I've never done this mix before, but I think it'll be cute. So now I'm finished, I'm going to be taking my um, Studio Fix, Fix Plus, whatever, and I'm going to be spraying it all over my face to set the makeup. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. Let me know if you like it. And if you do, please sum it up and don't forget to leave comments and don't forget to subscribe and also visit www.beessential.com. And yeah, thanks for watching guys.